Hey all, I'm Lance. We're working on challenge number one in the string section for scalar data types and introduction to Python. The prompt asked me to write a function called create three digit num. I'll go ahead and write my definition before I get too much farther into the description. And it says that I'm going to take in three integers as parameter, n, m, and p. So I'll go ahead and lay out my structure for those as well. Um, and we're going to combine them into one three-digit integer. Um, first, uh, we'll make p the first place, m the second place, and n the third place. And the return value should be an int. Um, it's telling us that we'll probably have to use string typecasting uh, to manipulate our inputs and then it gives us an example uh, 298 as our parameter should give us the number 892 so what it's saying is that I want I'll call this one a resulting string um, and we're going to use the string concatenation um, where we can add one string to the end of another using the plus or the addition sign um, if I were to just put in these uh, integers, n, m, and p, of course, we would make addition. Um, it would add those numbers together. That's not what we're looking for. We're looking to concatenate them. So we'll turn them into strings. Um, and it tells me it looks like p is the first place, and m is the second, and n is the third. It then wanted me to return uh, that resulting string although it said that it wants the return data type to be an integer so i can then cast that back to an integer as it started in this way when i run these tests i can see that um, i do get correct i will go ahead and show this as well in uh, regular vs code just so we can actually see what's happening um, step by step if we put in a print statement here and uh, print the resulting string right we can very well see um, that I have to call the function to actually get output so I will do that um, the examples it gave me was 8, 9, and 2. So I'll go ahead and try those. Save that file. Give it a run. Right, and I can see that 298 um, is actually what is printed out here. What we're seeing there is, is the string. Um, if I were to put a type check in here, right, we could see the type of it at this point is... Uh, string you see that is a class of string um, and then um, if we actually print when we call the function and put uh, a type call in there as well we will see the value is the same uh, and right maybe this time we will actually print uh, the int of the result string Give that a save, clear on my output, right? I can see that I get the same result 298, right? But this time what I've actually returned is an integer using the uh, int as a casting unit. Um, but as I mentioned for this challenge, right? The key to actually add the numbers um, into a larger number on integer with more digits um, is to cast them as strings and use the concatenation or the addition operator.